Oh my gosh, I love your hair. Thank Thank you. You. Oh. <laughs> get, over, get over yourself. She's crazy. She's crazy. That, you know what she does all the time? Not really. Oh my god. <laughs> She always gets <laughs> That's not true. That's what we actually met through Tinder. Yep. Ooh. Yeah, we did. Okay, so I know Bowie. Everybody knows Bowie right. for some okay. reason. Okay. Yeah. And then um and then uh, there's Pando Yum. So oh that my was, gosh, that's not That's girl. food, yeah. Yeah, that's food. Yeah, yeah. Food's good. It's always good. I love it. <laughs>
Right. Because he doesn't have the accent. Like, no, he doesn't. Yeah, I just saw his pictures before I met him, so I was like, oh, you look dainty, man. Oh, Zainab. So I want to meet your mother. Okay, but that's good. So, what did your dad say when he met you? So, like, so was it only your dad he met or your parents? I, was, I think it was your mom and dad. I don't know. I think it was. So, I walked. I was like, I was getting all excited. You know, I got ready and everything. I said, I'm going on a date. I'm going to finally meet her mom and her dad and everybody. So, when I first walked in, I said, I need to meet your dad. I want to do this the right way, the, res the respectful way. And so, I told, you know, I told your dad. You know everything that I was going to do. You know what time I said I'll be back. We'll be back at a responsible time, and all this jazz. And here we are. Here we are. So you're just my my dad, mostly. Because you know my mom is quiet. Did Did you have any stereotypes? Oh, you're tied you know, for not like, like a, a woman? stereotype oh, no. for maybe an African. You know, it was it was Zainab was my very first Nigerian that I swiped on, oh. and I was like, this is something new. I'm going to do something I've never done before. You know, I've I've dated, you know, white Americans, and I've had a lot of issues with. I won't say issue, but they had a lot of interesting adventures <laughs> that didn't go well. So I wanted. I've always told myself. I want somebody outside the country. And the reason reason said reason why I'm saying that is because when I went to Mexico, mm -hmm. everybody was so polite, everybody was so welcoming. And I thought that maybe that would be the same thing with somebody who was outside the US. And mm -hmm. I was one hundred percent correct. It was it was the best thing that's ever happened to me. Uh oh, somebody's <laughs> blushing. <laughs> Who's blushing? Not me, that's what I <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so um, any stereotype you heard about um, people mm. from Bulgaria or yeah. just in general? Funny thing, I did not know they existed. I was <laughs> so glad I met you. I was like, oh, yeah, Bulgaria. Boy, then I looked it up. I was like, oh, okay, wow. Uh, cool. <laughs> <laughs> I did I did a tiny bit of research, but it wasn't until after I, you know we started dating that the culture got more heavily you know involved with with my everyday life. I was like, wow, you guys do that? Do you oh, guys yeah. do this? No way. I mean, this is. And then when I heard about the Nigerian wedding after our you know we had a regular uh, white, white traditional wedding. White, white yeah. traditional wedding. Yeah. Uh, what do you call it? Just a white wedding. Yeah, yeah just a white, white wedding. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> just a white wedding. When I heard about the traditional wedding for in Nigeria, I was like, "That is something I want to do." Yeah, very absolutely lively. Li yeah, yeah colorful, that's exactly like, what I was like. Culture, yeah, and all that. Absolutely. Yeah. When did you think, or how did you know, it was the right time to propose? You know, that is an excellent question. I, I didn't. It just came to me. Um, I was like, "Yeah, this relationship is going great," and then one day, um, I told my mom. I've always told my mom and dad. Um, after college, after I get my bachelor's degree, after I have my own house, then I'll be settled. Right? I've always focused on that ever since I was little. Did that happen? <laughs> no, absolutely not. I was still in college when I figured out that she was the love of my life. I sat, I, I brought her home and I said, Mom and Dad, I love this person and I want to marry this person. And they were, they, they dropped their jaws. They're in shock. They're like, what? <laughs> what? Are you serious? How did you feel meeting his family? I didn't ask that. So. Uh, I don't know. I just, we, they were very different. Definitely. I've never been in an American home or, you know, especially uh, well, my yeah. boyfriend parents. Oh, okay. so, yeah. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, I just felt oh, probably different. I feel like a lot of people But feel were you that, yeah. accepted? You were accepted, yes, right? I felt yeah. very accepted. They were yeah. the nicest people on earth. It's like, they're uh, very unbelievable. Like, too good to be true, basically. Yeah. <laughs> and so, at what point did you pop the question after you told your parents? Um, well, that that is what point. Um, I did that in December. I wanted to do that a year after I met Zainab. So I had this all planned out. We, and um, I had a limousine. I, I, I rented a limousine and everything. The thing is, she knew about it. <laughs> <laughs> she Sorry. knew about everything. And I but said, how? He was obvious. so obvious. I still. Don't know I how. wish I didn't. 
But Ben is not the kind of person, if he has a surprise for you, you would know. <laughs> you would know. I, I don't know what it was. It's like, I was like, I was telling my mom about it. I had my mom help me choose, you know, the ring and everything. And I wanted to make sure that, I'm like, mom, I don't know anything about this. So I went to mom, she's like, oh, let me help you. And so it was, you know, we did that and it was like 20, 20 months ago in three weeks. That's when I, that's when I popped the question to you. Yeah. At Harry and Izzy's. And that's also on YouTube as well. So oh, yeah. <laughs> you might want to go check that out. Uh, I might look awkward in that video because part, because part of me knew and then I'm like, I don't know how to react. <laughs> I'm shocked and but it actually happened. <laughs> what should I, I do? Are you right now for real? Know. Yeah. <laughs> But how did you know though? That's the real question. How did you know? Because yeah, there's this one day I vividly remember uh, we were still at Sparks, the old apartment, and okay. he's like, What if I went on my knees and said, Will you marry me? <laughs> it was just a theoretical question. I was like, What and if? He actually didn't go on his knee, and uh, he, you were on the phone with someone too, and you asked me to close my ears. Oh, you didn't? Like, that would do anything. <laughs> That means you're really you. smart and very observant, though. <laughs> yeah, mm -hmm. I'm like, uh, something's up. Something's cooking. Mm -hmm. yeah, absolutely. <laughs> okay, so, um, you are from Bulgaria, right? Absolutely, and, yes. And you're Nigerian? Yes, I am. What part of Nigeria are you from? <laughs> right, you oh, Igbo, Oshu, I was yeah. uh, Yoruba, Oshu, right? I'm Yoruba, yeah. Oh, Yoruba. I heard Yoruba likes a lot of pepper. Do you give yeah. him hot food? Yeah, I tried so many times. He did Ooh. try it sometimes too. Oh, oh, there's this <laughs> one time he came to my house with my oh, dad's friend and my dad, you know, they're eating and, um, you know, party, kind of like a little party. Mm -hmm. And they invited Ben to eat with them because there's this smoked um, meat and pepper. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he wanted to show he was I wanted to a strong guy. I wanted to prove that I could handle anything. I said, don't do it. I don't even eat my dad's stew because it's very it's, spicy. Yeah. And he's like, no, no, it's okay. <laughs> he ate it. His color, face right? was red. I know. Oh, man. I was like, no, I'm I was, fine. I'm I was sweating out of pores that I never thought existed of my body. <laughs> and, I, uh, yeah, I warned you. <laughs> No, and then your mom warned me. I was like, this must be serious. <laughs> so let me ask, uh, what do you appreciate about the Nigerian culture? And, I mean, I and what do you right? appreciate about this culture? Because <laughs> now you've been exposed to a new co culture and yes. of course the same thing. Mm -hmm. So what that do is, you appreciate about um, the Nigerian culture? You know, that is that is an excellent question that, that has been brought up to me. So um, what I appreciate about Nigerian culture is how how welcoming and how warming when they bring in a guest. Mm -hmm. That is something that was unexpected when I first met Zaina. Everybody was like, you know, and the amount of food too. I was so <laughs> impressed with how much food they offered. Because I was never, never introduced to The hospitality to was, yeah. was mind-blowing, right? Absolutely. It was 100% mind-blowing. And so I did appreciate that. I think that, was, that is number one. Uh, so what do you appreciate about this culture? I'm going to say the clothes. I did look it up and they're... They're what? It's clothes? their outfit, yeah. Oh, it's yeah. their culture of clothes. It's very vibrant and um, pretty. What kind it's of clothes? Do you guys wear skirts? No, we do no, not. No, oh, that is in Scotland, like, right? Okay. Because <laughs> 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 it's Europe, so... Like, <laughs> it's kind of like African clothes with oh, the really? colors, yeah. Oh. But the shape, it just made... It's, you can tell the difference. You know, as an interracial couple? Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Like, do you get um, like Backlash. negative comments from people? Absolutely not. No, um, we actually get support. Just just one time when we posted our um, oh, wedding yeah, video. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I did ask my friends if they were gonna be uh, my bridesmaids. You know, mm -hmm. <sighs> I don't want to say Nigerians, but <laughs> yeah, they don't get back to me at all. And the date was getting really close, it was. and I didn't have anyone with me planning. And uh, I just asked my sister because she was familiar. She was a bridesmaid, bridesmaid once, and um, she was really quick with it. She got her friends, and uh, yeah, they 
were all I don't want to say white, but yeah, they were. They, they were. were really nice. They were yeah. really nice. They I were very cooperative with me and the colors I wanted. Yeah. And yeah, we just hit it off all together. We're still friends to this day. Uh, oh, that's yeah. Cool. Speaking of your bridesmaids, my best man. He was African American, and people were not expecting that because it was definitely a shock. They're like, "What?" You know, <laughs> they were expecting a white best man. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. and I was like, "You know, he's my—he's one of my best friends. I'm gonna have him as my best man." And um, we've been just having a lot of support, a lot of a lot of positive feedback Good on best, inter yeah. interracial couples, and it's been amazing. Yeah, that's cool. And uh, they have a a video about your your wedding, the wedding video. your wedding, yeah, the yes. wedding video, yeah, on YouTube. I'm gonna leave a link to that in the description, you know, so you guys can check it out and probably, you know, support them as well. Hopefully you Thank guys you. start making YouTube Absolutely. videos too, right? Yes, yes, we yes, want yes. to. We, we, we are just actually need to make the time. Yes, and the proper equipment matters, so. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, so. absolutely. Lighting. Um, you got any question I want to ask? Look, I thought you were trying to get my attention. Yeah, I was trying yeah. to tell you to tell them to say the name as well. Oh, okay. I said the name in the channel because I don't look it up. Oh. <laughs> what is it called? The Beckers? Um, you know, that's a great question. I just look up my name, Zainab and Yeah, Z A I N A B <laughs> space B, B as in boy, B E C K E R. Well, maybe it's Zainab and Ben. No, I think it's Zainab Becker. Really? Just well, my name? Maybe it's, maybe it's I don't <laughs> know. Okay. Something. okay, that's why you guys need to shoot some more, you know? <laughs> Absolutely. So I'll leave the I'll leave the name in the just, in the description, you know. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. But what advice would you have for, you know, anyone who is thinking about getting into, you know, such relationship? That That's it's a great a, question. It, yeah. For men especially. <laughs> well, I wanna, okay, let me say. Uh, for just but couples. I say, yeah, for, for couples, couples, you know. Mm -hmm. But um, if you could make absolutely. it make yeah, sense yeah, yeah, across yeah. It, it. Have lots of patience. Expect, I want to say expect problems because you don't know what yeah. you're getting yourself into. You yeah. want to make sure that... Uh -huh. Cultures. The culture, very different. There is a culture shock and that's why I'm, yeah. what my mom said, are you sure you know you want to do this? I said, yes, absolutely. She's like, there's going to be a culture shock. I have said, <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. It didn't hit until after when she said that. I'm like, this is the culture shock. <laughs> yeah. Okay. But everything went down. <laughs> but yeah. we, we, we are good. Have, have patience. Yes. Have patience with each other. Love each other. Communicate. For, communicate 100%. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's very big. Especially in generation <coughs> marriage. Absolutely. Hey, no ways. Talk about your priorities. And talk about, exactly. Talk about what, what you want to do in the future with each other. Mm -hmm. Talk about what you don't like, goals. what you do like, and goals. Absolutely. Boundaries, too. That's very important. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so. Yeah, All it's right. kind of like normal cultural things, but. Absolutely. I mean, it works for everybody. Mm -hmm. So Absolutely. thank you guys for watching, and um, we hope to catch you in the next video. And don't forget to subscribe, and also check out your video. The yeah. link will be in the description, yeah. okay? <laughs> so thank you for coming on the show. Thanks it's so a welcome. pleasure having you guys. Thank you. It was yeah, a pleasure as well. I enjoyed myself talking to you guys. Me so. too. Thank you so Maybe much. we'll be on your YouTube too one day. Absolutely, absolutely. That would be good. Wait. Awesome. <laughs> All right, guys. Bye. Bye. Bye.